Rishi's administration is planning to silently adjust the classification of disorderly demonstration in an alarming transformation. Current government strategy to impede remonstration slipped out in non-cooperation of the House of Parliament could have a nerve-wracking consequence on free speech in England and Wales, a Green Party colleague has cautioned. The expose that this administration is fixed to prescribe what comprises serious disruption from marches was emphasised in a House of Lords Inquiry Committee report on the 11th of May. It attests to an innovative guideline from ministers that would allow officers to enforce controls on protest creating additional disorder and disruption to everyday events, incorporating driving on the roads and high streets. The latest protocols, which cannot be modified by members of parliament or nobles as they are passed by Henry VIII powers, would also permit the law enforcement officers to contemplate the collective consequence of recurrent demonstrations when closing protests. They could shield any interruption by two or more individuals. The transformations come after related adjustments were recommended by the administration in January as a fragment of the Public Order Act and were overruled by the House of Lords, leading to their elimination. The grave situation with the climate crisis. So Just Stop Oil has one simple demand, and that is that the UK government put an end to licensing new oil and gas in the UK. But, but, but I'm interested to know about these tactics. What evidence do you have that blocking the busiest motorway in the UK, causing endless disruption for tens of thousands of people, is actually achieving anything? We need everybody to come to join us so we don't have to cause this type of disruption on, on the motorways. We need to be sat outside Parliament with tens and tens of thousands of people demanding an end to, to new oil and gas. Yes, but you don't need to resort to this kind of disruptive behaviour because what it seems to me what people are talking about, Indigo, are your methods and not your message. So your message is being completely lost because of the methods that you are using. Which, is in, which are infuriating people and disrupting life for mm. so many people. So the climate crisis is disrupting people around the world, around the world right now, and even here in the UK this summer, we saw the effects of the climate crisis with the UK getting 40 degrees heat and birds falling out of the sky and pensioners dying before they should. This is just the beginning, and the climate crisis is going to get worse and worse and worse unless we but, act. But we know and, that. But we and know we know that. We, cover that. that. we cover that on the news. We know all that. Yeah. I'm just talking about these tactics. The message you have, the message that you want to get across, get completely lost. I mean, your message is certainly lost on the woman who didn't get to hospital for her stroke treatment. Your message is certainly lost on the patient who didn't get to hospital for her cancer treatment. Uh, appointment and your message is also certainly lost on Tony Bambury, the man who missed his father's funeral. So uh, I guess my question is, what is the point of doing it like this? Mm. So it's very Please join the conversation. Put your comments and suggestions below in the comment section. Thank you for subscribing to this news channel. You will be notified of any breaking news and new post as you become part and parcel of the TAO Media family. Please like and share TAO Media. We love you all. Please support TAO Media Foundation by joining membership and visiting Amazon UK to purchase the displayed books to aid our orphanage projects across Africa.